Hey everybody, welcome to another video and in this one I decided let's not talk about Assassin's Creed because my sanity really, really needs to be saved. So instead I decided I would make a video on Watch Dogs, specifically speaking about whether or not we will be seeing a Watch Dogs 3, which is probably the most likely case because it's very un Ubisoft like to not make a third game. It's also very un Ubisoft like to stop making games in any franchise. They just continue until the, they kill everybody working for them, I guess. So, a little bit of backstory that we all know Watch Dogs 2 came out in late 2016, which was a good few months ago now. I think the biggest issue regarding whether or not we could see a, a Watch Dogs 3 is probably the sales for Watch Dogs 2, which probably weren't the best. Now, I heard they weren't great, and I, I, I know they weren't great. However, the company behind Watch Dogs 2 was in fact Ubisoft. Surprise, surprise, Ubisoft don't really need to rely on an individual franchise's sales to continue making games in that franchise. I feel as if Ubisoft at this point, for a while, could go without many great sales. So, the poor sales for Watch Dogs 2 don't immediately warrant that there won't be a third Watch Dogs game. And there probably will be a third Watch Dogs game, because come on, it's, it's Ubisoft. They're not, gonna, they're not gonna stop now that they've started with the franchise. There is no stopping, alright? There is no stop on that Ubi Milk train. So, that being considered, I am almost 100% in the basket that we are going to see a third instalment in the Watch Dogs franchise. I also hope there is a third game, because conceptually, the game could be great. I mean, both games don't really represent what the concept is trying to do 100% amazingly. However, I feel as if with a little bit more love and a little bit more time, they could eventually wind up with a Watch Dogs game that actually demonstrates what the concept is trying to make the game. As in my opinion at least, Watch Dogs 1 and 2 were mediocre at best. I mean, both games have features that I really, really like and the concept is something that I'm really interested in, which is why I'd like a third Watch Dogs game, of course. However, the games have just about delivered for me in the past, but they haven't really done much more than that. I say that because when playing Watch Dogs 2, you realise that Ubisoft didn't really think things through when they decided, let's put the player in a social justice heaven with two gun slots. And after so many hours, that was the only thing I actually found to do in the game. I kind of got a bit sidetracked there, but my point stands that I'd like to see Watch Dogs sort of nail it, so to speak, in the next game, or at least in a game in the future. I would love to see this concept fully realised in its full glory. Because Ubisoft are full of great ideas with potential, but when it comes to the execution these days, I feel as if it's sometimes, more often than not, a little bit lacklustre. I feel as if Ubisoft want to fully realise that this franchise and this concept as well, so I feel as if on that grounds there will also be reason for the existence of a third game, and if it's gonna happen, it already exists, we just don't know about it yet. And I definitely do believe that Watch Dogs 3 is in development because, come on, we're talking about Ubisoft, I've said this several times. They're very persistent when it comes to not giving up on a franchise, even if it does have a bit of a bumpy run. Which is a term that, between mixed reviews and poor sales, you can apply to the Watch Dogs franchise. All things considered, the fact that we're talking about a Ubisoft game here, the fact that that Ubisoft game is young, and all things like that, you know what I mean? It's basically, it basically, it has, to, it has to happen, doesn't it? A third Watch Dogs game is more inevitable than anything, unless Ubisoft goes bankrupt overnight or in the next couple of years. I reckon we're gonna see this fucker come out at some point, which I suppose is a good thing because Watch Dogs still has masses of potential just waiting there to be used, and it will eventually happen this third Watch Dogs game. Whether or not it uses the potential that it has is yet to be seen, but I feel as if maybe third time's a charm with this franchise because the past two games for me they weren't anything super special so maybe this third one will be something else. Being a Ubisoft game we all know that Watch Dogs 3 is going to be a thing like I have said about 600 times in this video it's just whether or not it's gonna realize the full potential of the Watch Dogs concept, or if it's gonna be like the past two games, which 
do realise it in a sense, but they don't fully realise it. They don't get the scale right, they're too busy pandering to social justice warriors or whatever the heck Watch Dogs 2 actually was. In my books it was a good game with a cringy, cringy layout from everything between sense of humour and morals. But Watch Dogs has never been terrible. That being said, I still have high hopes for the franchise. And although at this point we know literally nothing about a third Watch Dogs game, we can still be hopeful that this game cracks the concept properly. So yes, I do think we're going to get a third Watch Dogs game. And this video, although was trying to answer that question, I feel as if we ended up waffling into whether or not I think it's going to be good or hope it's going to be good, whatever. Uh, yeah. Y sure, same. But thanks for watching everybody, I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, share, comment, tell your friends about this channel and the video. Comment what you think down in the comment section, after all that's what it is there for. And I will see you all in the next one with another video. So yeah.